Hello and welcome back to Nether Survival Season 2. It has been a while in between episodes. Um, and I'm sorry for that, but I just, yeah. I wasn't feeling it for this series much more, and I apologize. I should have probably made this episode a lot sooner. Um, but I can say that this will be the final episode of this season. I know I have more planned, but... There is no point in me forcing myself to make something that I don't fully enjoy. And also, it is one of the least watched series on my channel and I have something much bigger planned. There will be a successor to this. Well, I think successor is the wrong word, but there will be a replacement to this series coming very, very soon that I'm very, very excited for. It is another themed and um, I, I think you're gonna like it. <laughs> I think you're gonna like it. And um, I'm, I'm certainly excited for it and cannot wait to get started with it. But I thought I would make a proper, uh, what's it called? A proper exit for this series, for this uh, series and season um, by finishing our second base. So we need to finish this area, figure out what it is to do with that. I need to finish up the walls. I need to make a little bit of a walk over here. And then I need to make a little bit of a tower. Um, yeah. Let's, uh, let's get to it, shall we? Um, I don't know if I like the iron bars. Let me see. I might have to do some resource gathering as well. Because, yeah, I do not have enough resources to do this fully. Um, but, yeah, I think... Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. Let's, let's try this. Let's try this real quick. Let's try this. There are possibly going to be a bunch of time lapses as well. Oh, I, okay, I already have one. There's possibly going to be a lot of time lapses because I want to get a lot of things done in a short amount of time. So we'll see how that is going to go. And yes, I did say make a tower over there. Um, now let's see how this is going to look. I think that definitely completes the theme. I don't think these warp ones are actually going to look that good. They look good. But these fit in better, so I'm definitely going to replace the iron bars with these fellas. So yeah, finish the walls, make this catwalk, make the tower, make a bridge to the tower, and finish this area right here. Um, and yeah, that's gonna be it. I might make another video just summing up pretty much everything that has happened in the last season. Also, I need to tidy this up as well. There's a lot of stuff to be done. <laughs> <laughs> and I have not been in this world for quite a while, so I may need to gather some resources as well. Right, I think I'm going to start with these walls right here. I don't know how much of it I'm going to time-lapse. I guess I could time-lapse this as well. You know what, let's have a time-lapse episode with a bunch of different time-lapses. I'll get started on this wall, and I'll be right back when it's done. Enjoy the building. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, can I, cannot, I cannot begin yet. Hold on. <laughs> I cannot yet begin with an unfinished window. Hold, hold on, this, this is just outrageous. There we go. Much better. <laughs> now let's begin the time lapse. Alright, that is this wall kind of done. Uh, I think I like it. I still need to add those posts, by the way. Um, I also feel like I want to add something in here. But anyways, I need to add these posts now. And also, bad news, I'm starting to run low on resources, which is not ideal at all. I could add something like this, but I don't know... How well it looks. I don't know how well it looks. Nor do I know if I should add these to it. I'm gonna leave it like this. Because I think that looks okay. I think that looks okay. I was thinking of also just adding gilded blackstone like here and here. Integrating that into the build a little bit more. I think I like that a lot more. I'm gonna do that over here as well because I like it. All right. Gonna add these laps now and then time for resources. All right. I think that is this part done right here. Still need to do that and still need to do the walk here. Still need to do the roof and this side over here. 
But I'm thinking of just adding in this. Um, yeah, I'm thinking like this. Doesn't have to go all the way down. I'm thinking this will be the doorway to it, and then we will have some fencing over here. Yeah, I think I think that will work. I think that will work. I definitely don't want it all the way over there. So I think um, cutting it like here. I know it's gonna look dumb, but I really don't want it to be close to these guys. It, it, because then we have this issue. Uh, 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 actually, cut this off for now. Uh, valuable quartz, come back. Because then. I will continue... No, I won't, because I need the stairs for this. I do have plenty of the blackstone, so I'm quite happy uh, for that. So I think I just need to place it like this. And we should be good. Nice. All right. And then we add red fences or blue fences. I think I add red fences to stick with the theme. Red fences going down, except for... Uh, hmm. Yeah, except for here, because I think we'll make the bridge here. So I actually think remove that and remove this and replace it with this and this. And then we can have a lamp sitting here and here. I think I like that. Boom, and boom, just sitting there. And we could actually also have two hanging over here, but I think it would be better if I make, uh, if I make some sort of roof to prevent that sort of stuff. Yeah, so we might not need these here, actually. Right, I need more resources in order to continue. I will be back. Oh boy. Whoa, hello. Oh uh, boy, nope, nope, not today, not today, not today. Oh boy. Eh. This is a mess. I don't know what to do. Gas and magma cubes are my least favorite mobs in the game. To be honest, it's mainly quartz. I have blackstone, I have the wood, I have all that, so it's pretty much just the quartz I need, and I need a lot. So, yeah, as I said. I'll be right back. All right, a trip later, and this is how much quartz I have. This should be, I believe, yes, two stacks of quartz blocks. Not much, but hopefully it will be enough to finish off this project. Now I just gotta be very careful not to make something that I don't actually need. And also, maybe even more importantly, don't die with it. <laughs> Because if I do that, then that's going to be pretty bad news. So I just realized that I wasn't recording the, when I returned. Um, whoops. I have made the walkway right here. Plus, I have made the ceiling here. So it comes out, then goes down a bit. Then we can connect it with the fences right there. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I moved the pathway over. I've decided to make the bridge here instead because it just matched up better with the poles and whatnot. And now I've basically decided to make the same kind of roof over here and then just basically top it off with fences, leave it open so we can see. I think that's going to look pretty well. Put it a seal a uh, wall and then up here and I'll just finish things off so it looks nicer on the top here. So that's what I've got to do in this coming time lapse. <laughs> okay, that was probably faster than what I did before. So I'll see you in just a second. Alright, so far so good. We now have a door. We have the roof here. We have a door leading out to this, whatever this is gonna be. Probably not gonna do any more to this than this because, well, it's really just a walkway. Um, realize that this is actually sticking out. 
So of course I needed a way to hide it and I think I did that okay well. Don't know how much I like this but I think it will work. I think it will work because we come from that area and then we come down, follow this. Of course all this have to go but I didn't bring my uh, my silk touch pickaxe for some reason. Nope, can't see it anywhere. Um, and then we of course we have the door here leading inside. I do think I want to remove these and add chain. And then hopefully they're gonna attach them to that. Yeah, might not look the best, but I just wanted to use the chains, change, uh, chains somehow in this. Maybe we'll do it here as well, actually. Oh, nope, that ain't gonna work. Maybe just here then. Uh, oh, that's not gonna work either. Okay, I'm sticking with the usual then. <laughs> okay, that is pretty much that done and I think all I have to do now is figure out what I have to do over here the rest is just the tower and I don't know if I have the resources to make a tower depending on of course how tall I'm making it but I'm thinking that tall maybe hello I think for the bridge I want to um hmm I want to do that. But of course, I want you to be like that. All right, something like that. Then I just need to make this buildable. And I want to follow the natural bits of this, if I can. Like, I don't want to fill all of this in. Because I want to, need to... Yeah, you, you go ahead and please... Thank you. Like, I want to have to make some support for this thing to stand on, like a floor. I guess that'll work. When it comes to the tower itself, I'm thinking a 3x3 three three would work. Kind of like here, if I just take these out, actually. I got 3x3 three three right there. We could then have a ladder going up. And then walls, of course, all the way around it. Let's start by getting the height. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We could cut it here, but I think 12. I think 12. Yeah, 12 is definitely going to look good. I need some ladders. All right, ladders. So going all the way up. And then, of course, remove this one. And then we would have some sort of floor up here we can actually stand on. Also, I think I just got a great idea. As the main wood we have used so here has been red, why not make the support be the blue wood? I think that could be... Okay, cool. I definitely cannot fill this whole thing in. That's 12 by 3, that is 12, 24, 36, so that would be 36, 36, 36, 36... Although, if I just get a little bit more quartz, I could do that. That would make it a square tower, though. I don't know how well that's going to look. But I do have a few ideas. Maybe. Like, if I, say, did something like... This. And then had quartz... In here. Right? I feel like that would be way too much of this. I don't know. Could not be. The, I, the, I hate these mobs. <laughs> too many. I'm gonna try and build it up a little bit and we'll see how it looks. Yep, way too little quartz. That needs to be more quartz in this. So I think remove these parts and move them to the corners. Then it'll just be a square tower, which... There's nothing wrong with it's Minecraft. Things are square. <laughs> so I think I'm going to do that. 
build this up. I'll need to get more quartz as well. And, um, yeah. I'll be our... Oh, boy. <laughs> I'll be right back. Enjoy the time lapse of building the tower. Let's go. And there we have the tower. This took quite a bit. <laughs> but here we have the tower. Here's the inside. As you can see, I've added the chains here to kind of hang from, from the ceiling. and have some lanterns underneath them. Now if we go up, we of course have the fences here. We can lock that if we, or close that if we want to. We have this room light here giving off light. And yeah, just keeping it simple. And I think I like the design with these warped... Um, uh, fences here and well this is kind of dangerous but yeah, yeah, it's fine probably fine but so that is the tower I also of course here you can see the ceiling looks pretty good and also I did underneath uh, under the base check that everything uh, looked as, as it should nothing weird blocks sticking out or anything so that is pretty good and also added the support here and of course around the tower as you can see and I think that is pretty good. I have one more thing to do before I'm done with this. I think I've probably been at this for like multiple hours now. One hour? Two hours? I'm not sure. Um, this right here. Need to finish these walls. This wall and this wall. And I think I kind of know what I want to do here. I have an idea. And in fact, I just developed it to another idea. So I'm going to do that. And I think we'll be done. Well, I do need to move in some furnaces and whatnot. I'll guess we'll put them here, maybe. Or maybe that could be in the corner over there. Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe over here. We'll see. I need to move in the chest and the lodestone and whatnot. But let me do this first. I'll be right back. All right, I think I like this. I think I like this. I'm gonna add this over here though, and that over there, and there we go. I think I like this, the lava is going in and then just kind of chilling here. I don't know if the iron bars is a good idea, but there's a little bit less of a risk of hitting it uh, if the bars are actually there. Next, I need to figure out a storage area for all this stuff, a place for my end chest, and a place for my uh, my respawn anchor and furnaces and lodestone and whatnot. And I'm kind of thinking the corner. But I'm also thinking here. But that could also work. Issue with here is that it, well, leads to the outside. And I don't really want that. Uh, so I think using this area here might be good. Uh, maybe. What do we actually have to place down? We need a crafting table, respawn anchor, smoker, lodestone, and furnace. Right. Hmm. I think I know exactly where to place the lodestone. It would almost only make sense to have it here. Right here. In the tower. It, it, it just would make the most sense, in my opinion. Uh, so we're going to place it there. Do we have an extra compass? Please tell. I should have... Yes. Perfect. We don't have an anvil here, so I can't really rename this thing, unfortunately. But it's fine. Boom. This now leads us to our second home. Perfect. And this is a bit of an issue right there. <laughs> Next, I need to respawn anchor down somewhere. And that's got to be there. Right there. And... 
I guess we could just place these down. Crafting table in the middle, smoker, furnace over there. Little crafting area, and I guess we could then have some chests going up, actually. That kind of makes sense. So one, two, three, blah, 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 blah. four. Perfect. So one there, one there, one there, one there, and then the other two there. I think that could work. Way too many items here. Uh, wait, I actually need to... Where's the chests? Oh, no. Why? Why? Why, are, why would they land on the roof? Wait, there's only one here. That's the other one. There we go. Two of them. All right, now I just gotta quickly transfer all the stuff in one of these. All right, that is everything transferred. We have food and tool stuff. And we have kind of miscellaneous, soul, soul, gravel, netherrack, everything that doesn't have a place. Wood stuff, basalt, blackstone, quartz, and obsidian as well. We have the respawn anchor here, which is not charged, unfortunately. And also the ender chest, which I now have to break because I do not have any soup touch stuff with me whatsoever. So we'll just have to remake this and uh, place it over here somewhere, I guess. To the left of this, right of this could work. So uh, I'm actually going to go home, gather a few things, and then we'll be right back here. I'm actually going to change this into here. Seeing that we don't really have much of this stuff anyway. Gravel and soul sand. Nice. I'll go home, get a few things, and we'll be right back here to end off the episode and the second season. Let's go. Home sweet home. Our beacon. We got... What's his name again? Bob. Right. Bob. <laughs> How could I forget? And, of course, we have our first base and hope, which is already invaded. Please get out of my house. It is not open for guests and visitors at this point in time. No, it is not. Okay, what I came here for is I need to rename this thing. Uh, where's my arrow? There it is. Base Delta 2.0. There we go. Base Delta 2.0. And need to place this back in its original spot, which is somewhere in this mess. Uh, right here, I think. Yep. Right there. Perfect. Nice. We actually have another lodestone in furnace. That's... That's... That's cool. <laughs> this is all the stuff we have. Uh, diamond, not diamond, ender pearl. And I need blaze powder. And we now have an ender chest. I don't think I need anything else with me. Let's see what we can get on the boots. We kind of want the finished set, don't we? Depth Spider. <laughs> uh, hmm. You know what, I'm just gonna go for it, because, yeah, I might as well, right? Uh, let me see here, though. Yeah, I'm gonna keep rolling these until I get something good. Uh, if I do one more, I have two shots, basically, at this. Protection three. Not as good. Not as good as Protection 4. Oh well. Yeah, only Protection 4. That's definitely not good enough. And now I need more Lapis. Uh, which I believe is like 3 gold, right? I don't remember. 3 gold it is. And hopefully this is actually going to work. Otherwise it is fine. But I would really like to have some good boots. Depth Strider 3. And oh, okay. The... I feel like me enchanting in this series is just like, nope. Well, they're almost broken, but I guess it's fine. Yeah, it'll have to do. It will just have to do. We didn't get perfect boots, but these have been pretty good. I wonder if they're falling on them. But, uh, oh. How can I, how can I get quick levels? I need to kill stuff. 
This was definitely not part of the plan. This is a slow tactic, but it will work. Almost there. All right. 30 levels. Let's go. Hopefully it will have protection, at least protection 3 and unbreaking 3 as well. Otherwise, I don't know if I can combine them with the ones that I already have. But let's go ahead and see right here. Feather Falling 4. Fire Protection 3 and Unbreaking 3. You know what? I'll take it. <laughs> I will take it. There we go. My armor, the rest of my armor did take a little bit of beating getting, getting to this point. But it's fine. This is fine. I like it. Um, there are more arrows. I do indeed. Perfect. And a shield. I need that shield. And a chest to bring with me. Could have used my Silk Touch pickaxe as well. But yeah, that is pretty good. Where's my good sword, I wonder? Oh, there it is. <laughs> That's the amazing one. Alright, let's head on over to uh, base Delta 2.0. And let's wrap up. Alright, we are back. Grab some glowstone as well so we can power up the respawn anchor. Boom. Gonna put the rest of this in here. And the chest I'm gonna plop down right here. Yes, right there. Perfect. And I think that's it. With that, guys, I'm gonna call it an episode. And with that, a season. I might do another video where I just walk through all the stuff that we've done and built. And stuff like that. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it, guys, for this episode and season. I really, really hope you have enjoyed. Now, again, something else will replace this. Um... Something else is replacing this, something big and something that I've been working on for quite a while. And um, I hope you'll like it. I think you will. It is leather themed and I think you'll like it. I hope anyway, because I'm very much looking forward to it. And I'm very excited to get it uh, started as well. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode and this season. I really, really hope you have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done so yet. And hit those notifications. Also, feel free to join my Discord server. Link down below in the description. And if you want to support me even further, you can go ahead and check out my Patreon page. Link down below in the description. But yeah, that's going to be it. Really hope you have enjoyed. And I hope to see you in whatever comes next or in my other videos. So if you haven't checked those out, be sure to check them out. <laughs> have a wonderful day and goodbye. Okay, I got those. I